Good afternoon. This is the 9th of September. I had to stop and think what month it is. This is Bella's Kids. I really apologize. Last week's video did not, I for some reason it would not load. We did it for 12 minutes, so today I'm going to make it shorter uh, so that we can get it to load. I'm going to give you some close ups of these guys. These guys are doing really good. Um, we've got a couple in here with a haircut. The two that have my name under them on the website is the little Merle with the pink collar, and she's right there. She has a haircut. So she has her first little schnauzer cut. And the other one that I'm keeping is over here. It's the black male who's sitting down not looking at me, so it's going to be really hard for you to tell. But they have huge coats. This whole litter is just awesome. Uh, hopefully they'll get up and walk around, but I'm not holding my breath. So, what I did was, this one's laying down his belly on the grass. That's the white collared puppy. I went through and had Vanessa give me collar colors and their last four microchips and how much they weighed. So, the, um, the male with the green collar in here, which is mine, right there. He is four pounds, four and a half ounces. So he's a chunk. Last four microchips are 6034. The purple collared female, which is, she's back here in the back. There we go. Right back there. She is three pounds, 1.5 ounce, and her last four microchips are 5509. And here comes my husband on the gator, so it's going to get noisy. Uh, let's see who's next in here. The um, let's do the white collar puppy. He's laying down here on the ground. There, he's gonna get him walk around. They are so cute. I'm dying to give them a haircut. By the way, if you do want a haircut, please let me know. I will be glad to do so. I am a fan of Schnauzer babies with haircuts. So if you want them fuzzy, that's great. If you want them clipped, give me a call. I'll be glad to do it. Uh, okay, the orange collar puppy, where, oh, where are you? I think he's right here. Yep, he's the chocolate merle right below me. Right there. He's like, he's like, where are you, huh? <laughs> they're, they're getting cute. They're just starting to play. They are four weeks, and I think, uh, what is it? three days old or four days old today so they're getting there slowly but surely so the orange collared male is three pounds six ounces and the last four chips are 61 67 the neon green merle is right down here with him he says get up and play Whoop. I guess it's neon yellow I'm sorry neon yellow it's the little merle male with a white spot on his head and let's see he is two pounds 15.5 ounces and i think he's the almost the smallest i think he nope he's not the smallest um and his last four microchips are 6804 there he goes he is one little woolly bear okay let's see where else are we going Let's move around here. The blue collared male, which is the black puppy on here. Whoops, there he goes. And I'm going to have to read my notes upside down. Okay, the blue collared male is 4 pounds, 3.5 ounces. And he's standing there looking up. He's busy. These guys are awesome. I just love their coats. Um, they're nice and thick. Super thick, actually. Um... They're going to have just gorgeous coats. They're going to be the most beautiful babies when they're full grown. Uh, the neon pink, which we didn't get to see up walk around, she's over here. She is thinking about playing with the toys, but they're not 100% sure yet. And I'm really sorry I'm wiggling, but I had a, a bug I needed to shoe. And the purple colored one is over there also playing. The pink female is... The pink collar female, I should say, is 2 pounds, 11.5 ounces. So she wins the prize as the smallest in this litter, I think. 
I don't think there's anybody any smaller than her. Nope, she's the littlest in the litter. Uh, you can see from her haircut how thick her hair is on the side. She sticks out like she's got a tutu. She's just not sure about this outside thing in this grass. And she's not sure she wants to enter in on the boys' activity level over there. So she's been hanging out over here with the puppy with the black, with the pink collar. That's the black puppy. So we have the active guys over there and the kind of like, I'm not sure I want to enter into this kids over on the other side. We're expecting a storm, so I'm hoping it doesn't get really, really windy. There's a really good picture of that pup with a haircut. She is gorgeous. She's got big eyebrows, big huge coat. She's just really a pretty, pretty puppy. The black one's like, I am not moving. His eyes are open, but he says, I don't like it out here at all. First time out like this takes him a little bit to get over the, the uh, anxiety of being away from mom and being out here on the grass. Some kids, and they're like kids, some kids do really good with change and some guys don't do good with change. About the time I finish this video, she'll start to get up and walk around and play. The pink, pu the pink colored puppy is up and she's starting to play a little bit. And these guys over here are having a wrestling match. So let me move around this side so I can get some pictures of them over here. Okay, there the purple collar puppy is going to explore the toy. These guys are going to enter her in on their wrestling match. She says, lay down, I'm going to walk over top of you. There she goes. She says, okay, I'm ready to play. See, it just takes a little bit. And uh, then they get going and they're good. Mine looks like it's going to pounce on somebody. It's on its belly with its head down on the leaf and its feet up in a position like it's ready to spring. It says, oh, I'm just stretching. And the little black one with the purple collar says, I'm just going to lay here and chew on the ear on this dog. Or maybe it's a pony that they've got out here today. We've got civil rights. Civil, yeah, no sibling rivalry going on down here. And they're both going to pick on her. Maybe the little black one with the purple collar feels safer out of this mess. <laughs> She's not willing to wander into this yet. Uh, the other thing I wanted to tell everybody, I have sent out today, or have, I'm going to finish when this is done, I started sending out everybody's uh, video information and your vitamin information. So you should receive two emails from me today. And those emails will have uh, the five videos that I would like you to watch before you come to pick up. If we're shipping your puppy to you, of course you won't be picking up, but you're going to get the same information just not the address and where to park and all that stuff. Um, she says, I'm watching, but I'm just not going to enter into this. The yellow collar says, come on, my tail's wagging. Let's go play. She's like, nope, not yet. So I'm not sure about this yet. She, oops, he says, I fell and I can't get up. Uh, so anyway, if you did not get your emails, please shoot me an email and let me know, and I will be more than glad to resend them out. Um, if you have not booked in for a puppy pickup, please do so. I would really appreciate it. And um, we'll get you another video next week, and I'm going to try and take pictures either this evening or tomorrow. So by Friday, we should have pictures on for you. And I hope you enjoyed their video. And yes, that puppy is fine. It's just one of those days. It's like, I'm not getting out of this spot. The world will roll over and I'll die. So, have a good one. And we'll talk to you soon.